we perform many routine tasks in CPRS all day. Each task may take many keystrokes and clicks. To minimize the burden of such repetitive tasks, Brillions provide the Quick Keys feature. As the name suggests, it quickly completes many tasks with one keystroke instead of many keystrokes and clicks. The Quick Keys feature is fine-tuned to expedite the view alert processing. You will see many examples in this video. For example, adding additional signers involves selecting one or more user from a long list. It is easy to type or select a wrong name. Similarly, we sign progress notes, addendums, and orders throughout the day. Each requires multiple clicks and keystrokes which add up to hundreds of clicks and keystrokes each day. When processing view alerts, we frequently add commonly used comments, for example, this request is taken care of. The Quick Keys feature allows you to enter such remarks with one keystroke. Please do not use CPRS Booster with Brillions. This is because Booster interferes with CPRS in such a way that it does not respond to commands sent by Brillions. There is nothing Brillions can do to remedy this conflict. This must be fixed in Booster. This message will be removed from this training video, once the issues are fixed in Booster. Please note that the CPRS booster and the Brillion's quick keys should not be used together. This is because, behind the scenes, they both use some of the same hot keys. The application you start first will work fine. The second app may or may not work normally. This is not an error. This is how the Windows system is designed. We recommend users use the quick keys instead of booster. The quick keys provide the similar functionality and avoid any conflict with the external application. You can activate and suspend the quick keys anytime using the hotkey or using the Brillion's clinical tools menu. The menu item shows activate or suspend depending on which action is appropriate. The control plus Q key toggles the quick key status between active and suspended. This has the same effect as using the quick keys menu. Sometimes, because of Windows issues, the quick keys may stop responding. Resetting the quick keys fixes this issue. You can reset the quick keys using the quick keys submenu. You can also reset the quick keys by pressing Ctrl plus F5 key once. This closes and restart the quick keys feature. Brillion's quick keys feature is designed to work with CPRS only. Therefore, the quick keys work only when you are working in CPRS. For this reason, nothing happens if you are working in another application, and, you press a quick key. For example, pressing a quick key will do nothing when you are typing a message in Teams. This is by design. The Windows system requires the application to have the focus to receive the keystrokes sent by the keyboard, or, by another app. Furthermore, the progress note related quick keys will work only when you are on the CPRS notes tab. The same principle applies to the orders related quick keys. If you are on the wrong tab, though the CPRS will receive the keystrokes, they may not translate to a sensible command.
Using the Quick Keys intuitive user interface, creating your personal templates is just as easy as using them. To open the editing form, click on the Edit Quick Keys Templates menu item on the Quick Keys submenu. This opens the template editor form. On the template editor form, the left pane shows the list of Quick Keys, such as Control 1, Control 2, Up 2, Control 9. When user clicks on a listed item, the template associated with that quick key is displayed in the text editor, next to the list. Needless to say, if you have not assigned a template to a quick key yet, then the display remains blank. The user can edit the template as often as needed, for example, to fix the misspelling, or, to improve the notation. For indenting lines, Please use spaces, do not use tabs. Proper line indenting is important for readability. Therefore, it is worth spending some time to get this right. When satisfied with editing, click the Save button on the bottom panel and close the form. If you need to assign an existing template to a different quick key, please see the user interface next to the Exchange button below the template editing area. To assign the selected template to a different quick key, select a quick key in the drop-down box next to the exchange button, and, click on the exchange button. This will ask for your confirmation, and, exchange the template assignment. Remember to save the templates after updating the quick key assignment. Brilliance shows the text for all the templates above the save button. This is for your information only. Please do not edit the text in this area. This may mangle up your templates, or, cause data loss. Brilliance provides an easy-to-use, intuitive user interface for creating list of the users you frequently add as additional signers. Normally, we select additional signers by typing each intended user's name in CPRS, one by one. Not only this requires many keystrokes, but, there is risk of selecting a wrong person due to many similar names. Brilliance allows each user to create a personal list of frequently used additional signers. How do you bring up this list when needed? You don't have to do anything. When CPRS asks for the additional signers' names, Brilliance automatically displays your personal list. Using the mouse clicks, you can select the additional signers you want. 